regarding me. Now, let me tell you something. This is regarding me, one. And now, let me tell you something. This is regarding me, one. And if I was such a racist, why was I so concerned about you drinking small with a beer like a freaking maniac alcoholic on all your videos? What did I tell you? What did I tell you about that? You know what? I really liked you. I accepted your phone calls. You know, I accepted all that stuff. You telling me all of your personal problems. Never happened. Do not, do not, you do not know who you're messing with, okay? Don't mention my name again, okay? Because let me tell you something. You're going to be really sorry. I mean, really sorry. You do. You, and I, I'm just waiting for you to do it. Go ahead, do it. And the message to do it. Okay. Th that threat is nothing compared to the phone call that I had where I had to hang up on her. And I'll be honest, I knew she was going to call back and leave that message from the way that she lost her fucking mind. Okay? So you lose your mind because you're nuts. Okay? There's no God inside of you. You don't know what you're doing. You're a cult. You're, you are ready and ripe to join a cult, my friend. So listen, stop calling me a liar. You're the liar. You're the racist. I just proved that you did threaten me, okay? Don't call me anymore. Don't, don't do anything to where you're going to have any contact with me or I'll get a restraining order. Do you understand me? Okay, stop harassing me. Shut your mouth. Make a video and stop typing like a mad fiend. Don't type with the big capital letters like you're yelling at me. Okay, you're way too aggressive to be like Christ. Okay, I'm not some demon, okay? I like to read, okay? And you hate me because I read books, okay? I read books, I read all sorts of Bibles, man. I read all sorts of stuff. You give me something, I'll read it. You'd burn all the books, you'd burn the libraries, wouldn't you? There's something wrong with you, okay? All of you people that don't want to read and just follow around instead of investigating. So I'm going to tell you, you mess with me again, I'm going to get a restraining order on you, period. Okay, you're a whack job. And uh, for one of the ones, uh, these are the Christians that are following you, okay? And uh, might make you wonder a little bit. I hope you gave her your phone number already. Can't wait for that one, right? I've got nothing to hide. I'm not a liar. I, I do this because I care about people and I want them to try to wake up and save the world. Okay, uh, anybody who has um, an inkling of what's going on understands what they've done to our food, our air, everything. Um, you know, we could talk for days and days and days about the system. Okay, I'm well aware of the system. Bottom line is, learn to read people, get into the books. Don't be like these, these people that are very narrow-minded um, like I call this other older woman today a blockhead. She's like a total blockhead. I spent, just wasted my whole day to day with this person. And in the end, they won't look at any information because they already know. And for any idiot that thinks that they know everything, which I already heard uh, one of the ones say that, you know, he knows, okay? God's not talking to you, brother, okay? Um, anybody who understands knowledge knows that it goes on forever. Forever, okay? When I pass away here, I believe I'm getting another job and that there'll be much more knowledge given to me. Forever, it goes on forever. Um, there's nothing in this world that uh, doesn't transmutate um, or transmorph, however you wanna look at it. Uh, we can talk about physics, whatever you guys wanna talk about, okay? Uh, stay away from me regarding me one because you're the liar. Okay, you're the liar. Okay, don't judge me. Okay, you, you, if you are any Christian, if, if you're into this whole Christian thing, that you know by stating that you're judging me, that you're damning yourself to hell. Because what you, what you judge me by is what you'll be judged. Okay, I'm not trying to judge you. Okay, bottom line is I'm pointing out what a crazy nutsack you are. I'm tired of this crap, man. You guys are like walls. You know, if you if you don't take in real information, if you don't look at books to decipher different people's points of view, how will you have your own? Uh, you know, for these people that are trying to tell me that, uh, 
you know, I'm following all these other people. And man, hey, I love philosophy, love poetry. I'm not going to sit here and stop reading or stop thinking because you say that I can't do it because it's going to damn me to hell. Okay, it's ridiculous. You know, anybody who knows anything, and I'm going to keep saying these little things, and I don't care if you don't like it or not, okay? They're very, Christianity and, and the Old Testament, the New Testament, very different books, okay? And, you know, anybody knows in the Old Testament that, that God, to even say that Satan's even close to being near God is, is insane, okay? God ha is everything, and he controls everything. So uh, you can choose to sit there with your head in the sand. I've already put out the videos uh, for the lady. I don't even remember her name now. I made the playlist with the books in it. Go read those books. If you have a grain of integrity, like I told her, I said, if you have a grain of integrity, you know, you'll go look at this. And she told me that I needed to seek mental help because I read. And she's another book burner. And, and you guys will all be happy because guess what, man? When this, this war ensues, they'll be burning all the books, man. Trust me on that. Knowledge is power. They don't want it in your hands. So you can either wake up or stay where you are right now following some man. <sighs> anyway, that's the first time that happened. But anyway, uh, you guys are just tiresome, man. It's like dealing with little kids in a playground. Um, it, I'm open for anybody with real debate, anybody that wants to talk. I'm not here to look better than anybody else, but I'm getting really sick and tired of these, these people that talk like they know what they're talking about. And anybody who knows, knows that when, the more you learn, the less you know, because it becomes more vast. Knowledge is forever. You know, <laughs> you know, regarding me one, you're insane, okay? You flip flop. You you you're you're like that wife that'll go back to the, the guy that's beating her up all the time. Why do you even talk to Bill? He treated you like shit. Someone treats me like shit, I move on. And that's what I'm telling you to do. Move on, cause you're you're a whack job. Okay. I don't want to associate with you. I don't want you talking to me. You're a racist. I don't like you. Okay. I don't care that you liked me once. You want me to play it again? You threaten me. Okay. Stay away from me. Uh, or I will advance this into a legal th issue with you, which I'm sure you know by now uh, could possibly happen with that, that audio tape. Okay, that was a viable threat. And let me tell you, ladies and gentlemen, it was nothing compared to the phone call conversation that I had to have with her. And I just hung up, man, because she lost it. You're a whack job, man. And uh, one of the ones told you around a bunch of snakes, okay, just proved it to you guys, okay? She's the liar, not me. You're the one calling me and threatening me, okay? Think about it. Come out of the the, the, warp, the, the warped vision, okay? Don't hate me because I read. That's like the most stupid thing you could possibly say. All of you guys are dumb because you don't read. You're following other people. You don't study on your own. And if you don't do it yourself, you're never going to know. And if you're scared to look at other stuff because you're afraid it's going to disprove something, you know, there's only one book that I need. There's only one book. We well, better open up that book, man, and look around because there's a lot of stuff in there that you just don't get. And for the for the dummy that I was talking to earlier, the old lady, who uh, you know seems to know everything about uh, everything already, did you look up allegories or did you look up the pre-Masoretic texts? Okay, the allegory means there's something with inside what you're looking at. You know, don't you know if I know it and you don't, that makes you the outsider in the Bible, doesn't it? Last I checked, that would make you the outsider. And a pre masoretic text, you might want to go into that. I've got some pictures on my, one of my videos. I made a playlist just for you so you didn't have to go look for it yourself.